Howdy, it's Marissa from Marissa Moments, and today is Wednesday, March 18th, day three of the quarantine. Yes, I do have on the same shirt from yesterday, but it is one of the perks of being in quarantine, you know what I'm saying? And uh, who's anyone to judge? Wear what you want, you're at home, or at least you should be, you know what I'm saying? So anywho, I do have a nice special treat for you guys for today. I've actually brought in a couple of experts. So without further ado, I will introduce my very first expert. Here she is. Oh, well, hello there, Miss Vanessa. Well, hello. Thank you for joining us. You're so welcome. <laughs> All right. So my question to you is, how do you feel about this whole self-quarantine situation? Well, I feel pretty good, actually, because you're keeping yourself safe and everyone else around you safe. Okay. And how do you feel about those people that are leaving their homes without ne necessity? Well, that's ridiculous. The only reason why you should be leaving is because going to the store and you can order online. Mm, there you have it, folks, from the mouth of babes. And how old are you again? I'm 10 years old. Soon to be? 11. Okay, when are you going to be 11? April 7th. Hmm. Well, would you look at that? This is from the mouth of a 10, soon to be 11 year old. So if you don't have that down pat, something wrong with you. Thank you so much for visiting. Mm -hmm. All right, so I did mention I have a couple of experts. So one isn't a couple two is. So without further ado, here is my second expert joining us now. Hello. Hello there, Miss Jasmine. So nice of you to join us. All right. So my question for you is, how do you, what do you feel about the coronavirus? I really, I really don't like it because like some people don't even get to go to school. Like maybe in like, I think in a certain country, they, they might not be even going to school for a whole month. So you never know. Maybe they're gonna go to the next week, gotta redo that great, redo it. Wait, no. I know, it's, yeah. a, it's a crazy situation. Yeah. And what do you feel about the whole sickness part of it? Well, it's really dangerous because like, like you could get really sick and you could probably die from it. Oof. Yeah, and yeah, and I think the biggest part of that, that's a very good point. The biggest part of that is that you never know. If you get sick, even when someone is healthy, they can pass it to someone who's not healthy, and it can have a really dangerous effect on them. So that is a very good point. And this is from the mouth of a, how old are you? An eight-year-old. Eight-year-old. Yes. Look at that. All right, well, thank you so much for joining no us. No problem, ma'am, and no problem with everybody else. Okay, so with that said, basically what we've learned today is stay at home. The coronavirus sucks, and we don't like it, and we want to get rid of it as soon as possible. So everyone out there, you need to do your part to make sure that we flatten this curve. Don't go outside unless absolutely necessary. There are different options out there in order to get things delivered to you. Um, you can order takeout food, and you can request a, a no-contact delivery to have the food dropped right outside of your door and you can have groceries delivered the same way. Um, of course, there are plenty of other different options out there. Just go on ahead and let your fingers do the walk-in on Google and uh, research things. Make sure you're informed, but most importantly, make sure you're at home. Let's, let's cut everything down. But anywho, thank you so much for watching. And if you like what you see, what should they do? Like and subscribe. And click the notifications for you never miss a video from <laughs> um, my mommy. All right. Well, thank you so much for watching, and we will catch you next time. Bye. Bye. Stay healthy and stay safe. Yep.